In this month's tooltip, we'll cover the wreath and kaleidoscope tools in our software. These tools are found at the lower center part of your workspace, and you can select the wreathing tool, and then use the fly-up menu to select the number of items that you would like to have wreathed around a center access point. Wreathing works with even and odd numbers, where kaleidoscope only works with even numbers. It requires pairs. You can see that these shapes, these simple shapes, have been mirror imaged, and again, these mirrored pairs are then duplicated around a central point. The central point can be rotated anywhere around the design, and once the design is created, I'm going to hold down my control key to constrain these pieces along the axis, and then I can click to create the kaleidoscope or wreathed object, and I have the option to merge. If I select to merge, I create an entirely new shape that is one single object. If I select to not merge, then I can keep the individual components. And this works with simple shapes as well as very complex designs. I can switch back and forth between wreathing and mirroring and create an entirely new design from a simple shape. If I would like to use a entire design, this works as well. I can select wreath, I can hold down my control key to constrain the design, select, and that quickly I've created an entire new design to place on the project of my choice and this is ready for stitch out.